Namaste, my dear friends. Welcome back to our channel, Vini Yoga FAQ. And today we are going to begin a new set of frequently asked questions on the topic of how the values presented by yoga compare to modern day values. And the first topic I would like to talk about is the value of youth. You see, in modern society, that we are youthful, that we remain young, is very, very, very strongly valued. There is advertisements everywhere. There are advertisements about uh, anti-aging products, anti-aging supplements, anti-aging skin creams and diets and things like that. And youth is very much valued because it is a very vain thing. It's a vanity idea. It is presented as youth is better. When you are younger, you are better. Uh, you have more energy. You have to be as if you are always young. You have to be like you are young, etc. Now, this is a sad reality because it's completely contrasting to what the reality is. And the yogic value is very consistent with reality, which is very different from how modern people perceive. In yogic values, we acknowledge that life is going through different stages and that each stage is very important and that we value each stage for what it is and that the joy that we experience is by embracing the present moment. So the yogic value acknowledge that we are having four stages of life. When we are young, we are infants and young people. That is called the Brahmacharya stage. And that is an important stage in life. For us to learn, for us to grow in our body, in our mind, in our energy, etc. But that will at some point end and the second stage of life will start which is the responsibility era, which we call the Grihasthashrama, the family life. And here we have responsibilities at work, we have responsibilities in our family, growing a family as parents, etc. So yoga says focus on this responsibility at this time. Don't expect to be like you were in your teenage years. It's not going to be possible. Your body will change. Your mind will change. Your metabolism will change, etc. Slowly, we come to the third stage of life that is called as Vanaprastha, which is the retirement phase. And this is also natural as we get older. Our capabilities in our body level becomes restricted, our metabolism changes, our energy level changes, our sleep pattern changes, our body is like a well-used machine. If you have an old car, even though you service it very well, it is still an old car. The same way when we grow older, our body, even though we have maintained it very well with our health, with our wellness and fitness practices, we still have to acknowledge that it is a well-used machine. So yoga says, acknowledge that you are in this stage, change your lifestyle, change your diet, change your habits, change your perspectives consistent to this life stage. And finally, the fourth stage is what we would call as uh, sannyasa ashrama, which is the very, very close to our death, which is the very elderly state where our body becomes even more limited. So, Yoga is saying that even this stage is very important because this stage is where we are preparing for our final ending, our time to go beyond this world into the next. So yoga is not only valuing youth and the idea that we value only youth is a big lie because in reality we are not always going to be youthful. We may have a very good health but 
we have to acknowledge that life goes through different stages and that's a very important reflection for us to embrace that our body our mind and emotions and our metabolism everything goes through different stages at different stages of life and this is a reality we have to accept this is very important my dear friends because time is like a river you know you can put your hands on the river and let the water flow but as time passes you will never touch the same water again because that water has flown and that's what we have to understand that time is like that our life is like that we cannot stay in our past how much ever we want to be only youthful like we were when we were young time has taken us away that 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 river that water has flown we need to embrace the new water that is flowing now and that is why yoga teaches us to honor every stage of life and not just the youth namaste dear friends Namaste friends I am Kaustubha Desikachar of the Vini Yoga tradition and I'm very very glad that you have come this far in the video if you have come this far it means you really like and appreciate our videos and let us know how you feel about it through comments below let us also know that you appreciate it by giving us a thumbs up and also clicking the notification icon so that we will be inspired to produce more free and valuable content like this and we let the community grow so please 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 subscribe to us so that the algorithms pick our videos in a much better manner and thank you for sharing these videos through your social network so that it reaches as many people as possible this is the best way we can do to share nice content with our close friends and our students and other people who we care about and be safe and be happy and be healthy as we are going through very difficult times but let us remain connected to our heart with hope and shraddha namaste